Max. And this is The, the Stag Report. Report. Few so elections have ended and the results are in, so why not talk to current president, Alex Long? For those of you who don't know him, he's a peach. A real gem. Class of 2015 recently received their beach house lottery. Now students can tell their parents that they've signed to live in the Naughty Virgin. Students will also be giving new meaning to the phrase, drunkenly stumbling around to find the G-spot. That one gets me every time. Dustin Hoffman just spoke at the Quick Center on February 20th about his career at the upcoming movie he'll be filming here on campus. Dustin Hoffman is the winner of two Academy Awards and six Golden Globes, which you all probably know better as that guy your mom swears was in that one movie with that woman. You know what I'm talking about. That's, that's how I know. That's, that's how. Yeah. This past week was Siblings Weekend. Hopefully it was a magical three days in which students showed their parents the beauty of Fairfield and their younger siblings everywhere they've grown up on campus. That bush, bush. That, that bush. bush. Not that bush. Maybe that bush. Everyone's grown up in that bush. Yeah. <laughs> Fairfield University's website recently underwent a massive reconstruction known as Fairfield 2020, leaving many students to ask the question, why? But kids, don't worry, sure, you only have hot water three days out of the week, but you can sleep soundly at night knowing that the school's website now has a link to their Instagram on it. We, we have an Instagram? Oh, yeah. Is it artsy? Oh, hashtag Fairfield, hashtag artsy, hashtag YouTube. <laughs> All right, few selections have ended and the candidates have been chosen. Who better to discuss them with than current Fuso president and recent campus cutie, Alex Long. Come on out, Alex. Ugh, oh, didn't even attempt to make anything on that clap. What was that? Alex. Sam? How are you? Max? If only there was a field here, I would have my old chair set it back. <laughs> <laughs> that one would have killed in Senate. It. 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 All right, it's wonderful to have you here, though. Uh, thank you for taking time out of your busy schedule. Which brings me to my first question. What do you do here exactly? And be specific. Okay, uh, well, I show up to a lot of meetings. I meet with various people, so that's good. And um, I mean, to be completely honest, I pretty much just prank phone call people out of my office all day. That's so. what I thought. Yeah. Do you have a character, or is there something you go with? Or? Well, Chip Douglas, of course. Shut up, Chip. 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 Yeah. They've got a call from Chip. <laughs> About, from admissions? <laughs> Maybe. Oh. So, Alex, it seems that you've held very close relationships with the past candidates. Is this true? Yeah, that's very true. They're really all great friends of mine. So, in a serious question, we have Coochie, Anif, and Janice. You gotta date one, marry one, kill one. Go. Okay. Um, I would date Anif. He's always feeling some type of way. I don't know what kind of way, but he's feeling it. I would marry Janice because she's sassy. She'll keep me in line. And I would kill Coochie because, frankly, why wouldn't I want another year in office? That's it. Assassination is key. It's that type of politics that drove you to the position in the first place, isn't it? Uh, no. <laughs> no, that's not it. <laughs> well, thank you so much, Alex, for being on our show. And congratulations to the new FUSA president and vice president. This has been the Stag Report. Consider yourselves informed, Fairfield.